the headmasters of the three senior high schools all protocol observed. This afternoon, I am highly delighted to, on behalf of the district director, receive these items from our honorable MP and also to respond on his behalf. In fact, we all know that this school suffered this fire disaster and uh, it's a very big stress on management of the school. And we are very, very, very happy and very grateful to receive this donation from our MP. It's a sign that he is indeed our representative in Parliament and is ready to champion our cause. Honorable MP, God bless you. Permit me at this juncture to, on behalf of my district director and the headmasters, put out a few requests. We know that our MP is a hardworking MP. He is very good at also lobbying to, for support for his people. So we, we are hopeful that God through you will answer some of our requests. Now, when you look at the three senior high schools in the Bukuru Nabandori district, we have only one pickup that serves the Bukuru Senior High School. It is very stressful. It was mentioned by the Nabandori Senior High headmaster. So we want to appeal through you to governments that the Nagwandori Senior High School and the Prairie Senior High School also need students. <laughs> On the part of vehicles for work in GES, we are very happy that the MP made a donation of four motorbikes for the Ghana Health Service. And let me register that the MP, when he entered into office, he promised GES a motorbike. We are very hopeful that motorbikes will come and not just a single motorbike. So, all right. What hard to give us motorbikes. It may also interest you to know that GES Directorate has created two more circuits. We have Bunkuru Central and then another district uh, circuit for Bibabu. So, in our district directorate, we now have eight circuits instead of six. I may also interest you to know that two sons of Nabandori have been appointed as such supervisors. That's right. Oh. <laughs> so, we need motorbikes for our circuit supervisors. So, honorable, we know that this will not be too much for you. Chief, can you can give us motorbikes? Now, on the part of our senior high schools, in fact, there is no school that has a dining hall. Looking at the structure ahead of us, it has outlived its usefulness. And the capacity is even too low to house this high number of students. So, on behalf of my district director, and the headmasters, we make a passionate appeal that our MP should still use his lobbying skills to lobby for the completion of the Nakwanduri Senior High School dining hall that has been started, 
the Kunkrugu Senior High School Danny Holder has been started. And even for Presec, there is nothing there at all. So please, MP, this is our request. We still know, know that you can do something about it. Now, on the part of water for our schools, The massive students gathered here know that this school wouldn't have existed if not for this stream. So, honorable MP, and all those who can help, we are making an appeal that more water facilities should be provided to our secondary schools, especially in fact, we all know that for students to study very well, their health must be enhanced. And if they drink water from the stream, how will their health be enhanced for them to continue with their education? So, honorable, do us a favor. Now, the very last appeal that we want to make is about learning materials. We have been reliably informed that the fire that consumed the dining hall, sorry, sorry, the dormitory, the dormitory, sorry, it happened with books that were bent. So we want to appeal that learning materials be provided for us and that dormitory should also be renovated. We believe that when we do this, it will help to enhance education in our directorate and also in our schools. So on this note, before I take my seat. I once again want to thank you so much and assure you that these donations will actually be used for its intended purpose. Thank you very, very much. <laughs>